Hello and thanks for taking the time to review your details in MindGS1. We really appreciate you helping out here. To make things a bit easier, we thought it might be useful if we went over some of the key things to look for when updating your account. OK, let's start with looking at how to review and update your company details. From our website, click Log In and then select My GS1. Enter your username and password and then click Log In. If you've forgotten your password, just click I've forgotten my password and it will be emailed to you. Once you've logged into MyGS1, click MyGS1 Dashboard to view your company details and click the Edit button to review and update your company address details if necessary. When you enter your address, it may appear in a drop-down. If it does, just click Accept Address. Note that there are two addresses, one for your postal address and one for your street address. These may be different. When you enter the address details, if they do not appear in the drop-down, then you can just enter them manually. If you make any changes, remember to click the Save button. From your My GS1 dashboard, you can also review your administrator details and add any new users to My GS1. You can also edit details for any existing users and delete any users who no longer require access to My GS1. To review and update payment and invoicing, select Financial Stuff. Here you can review and update any existing credit card details and service line authorisations. You may find it convenient to pay invoices using a credit card if you don't do so already, as it saves time. If you'd like to do this, you can add your credit card details here and select what services you would like it to be used for. You can also review and update how you would like to receive your invoices. Thank you again for reviewing your details in MyGS1. We really appreciate your time. And if you do have any inquiries or would like assistance, you can contact us by email, phone, or view our documentation in the Help Centre.